Hey everyone, my name is Jack Wallen, and together we're going to find out how to create authorization credentials in Jenkins. Let's create a new domain called Web Servers. We can then add authorization credentials to that domain. To create a new domain, log in to your Jenkins instance and click Credentials in the left navigation. You should see a new entry appear under Credentials called System. Click that, and you'll then see Add Domain. Click that, and a new window will appear. In that new window, type Web Servers as the domain and type an optional description. Next, click the Specification drop-down and select Host Name. In the resulting new text area, click the drop-down to the right of the text area to expand it such that you can add multiple host names. In this new area, type all of the optional IP addresses or domains that will be associated with this domain, one per line. Once you've typed the addresses, click the Save button and the new domain is ready. In the resulting window, click Add Credentials in the left navigation. You will then be required to fill out the necessary information for the new credentials. If this is to be an SSH username with a private key, select that from the Kind drop-down. When adding SSH private key credentials, you must copy and paste the necessary ID underscore RSA dot pub key for the user into the new credential. But first, type a username for the credential, and then click Enter directly, and then click Add. In the resulting window, paste the SSH key. Finally, type the passphrase for the key, and click OK. If you want to learn more in the ways of everything tech, be sure to subscribe to our Tech Republic YouTube channel and watch more how-to videos at How to Make Tech Work.